San Miguel Corporation's Skyway Stage 3 project is a game-changing development that ushers a turning point for Philippine economic growth. Completed under the term of President Rodrigo Roa Duterte, whose leadership and political will paved the way for the resolution of right-of-way issues that once hampered its development, Skyway 3 is a testament to what can be achieved when people work together for the greater good. For SMC President Ramon S. Ang, Skyway Stage 3 gives a much-needed boost to the country's economic outlook in this time of the pandemic and provides a significant impact on a nationwide scale. Stretching 18 kilometers from Buendia, Makati, all the way to the North Luzon Expressway, it fulfills the dream of connecting North and South Luzon. By doing so, it will greatly reduce traffic on EDSA, the country's busiest thoroughfare, and for so many generations, the only link from north and south until today. An engineering marvel dreamed up and built by Filipinos for Filipinos, Skyway Stage 3 is the longest elevated expressway in the country. In an industry first, it also features three double-decker sections an engineering solution to severe limitations to space along some of the densest, busiest parts of the metro. In completing the project, San Miguel Corporation funded the rebuilding of three major bridges, the San Juan Bridge, Concordia Bridge, and Sevilla Bridge. Rivers in these areas were dredged and cleaned. With the Skyway Stage 3, travel time from Alabang to the North Luzon Expressway is now just a 30-minute breeze through a high-quality anti-slip asphalt road from the usual three hours in traffic along EDSA. Buendia to Enlex will only take 15 minutes. Taken together with the existing Skyway 1 and 2, the Skyway 3 extends the Skyway system to 38 kilometers and now provides access to most major Metro Manila cities. With the upcoming completion of the Skyway Extension Project that will provide direct access from Susana Heights in Muntinlupa, the Skyway system will have a total of 36 access points, making travel more convenient for many Filipinos. Together with the Naia Expressway, Skyway provides direct connectivity to Muntinlupa, Las Piñas, Paranaque, Pasay, Makati, Manila, San Juan, and Quezon City. Skyway 3 also connects to the C3 Road, providing access to Navotas, Caloocan, Quezon City, San Juan, Makati, and Pasay. More significantly, Skyway 3 bridges the gap between the South Luzon Expressway and North Luzon Expressway unlocking the true potential of our provinces by further enabling transportation, tourism, and trade. With direct access to more markets, our agriculture sector and many local industries are set to get a major boost from this game-changing infrastructure project. New economic zones and major manufacturing hubs, both in northern and southern Luzon, will also greatly benefit from faster, easier, safer connectivity. San Miguel Corporation's next major infrastructure project, the Pasig River Expressway, which will connect to the Skyway, will complete the north-south and east-west link in Metro Manila. A 19-kilometer elevated expressway along the banks of the Pasig River, Parex will connect Manila to Rizal Province and provide faster alternative access to Makati, Ortigas, and BGC. The project will also realize the long-held dream of cleaning up and rehabilitating the Pasig River. Finally, Skyway 3 is envisioned to connect directly to what will be the Philippines' largest, most modern airport, the Manila International Airport in Bulacan, another game-changing project by San Miguel Corporation. The airport, to be designed and built sustainably, will also be future-proof. It will have four parallel runways to eliminate the delays and inefficiencies that have become the norm in Philippine aviation, 
which have cost both our government and our people billions in opportunity losses. Skyway Stage 3 is a major achievement for Filipinos. As with any major undertaking, it would not have been possible without the support and cooperation of many stakeholders, past and present. In particular, San Miguel Corporation expresses its gratitude to President Rodrigo Duterte for his vision and strong leadership and the support provided by his economic team to ensure its completion, particularly in settling contentious right-of-way issues. SMC also credits DPWH and the Metro Pacific Tollways Group under Mr. Manny V. Pangilinan for making the direct connection to NLEX possible. San Miguel also cites Meralco and National Grid Corporation of the Philippines for their cooperation in enabling the transfer of utility lines which help pave the way for the project's completion. For San Miguel Corporation, this is just the beginning as it continues to invest in vital infrastructure projects. This includes the completion of MRT-7, SLEX TR-4 and TR-5, which will extend all the way to Matnog, Sorsogon, TPLEX extension to Lawag, Ilocos Norte, and the Pasig River Expressway, which connects Eastern and Western Metro Manila and making access to our financial districts easier and faster. At this critical time in our country's history, San Miguel Corporation is committed to investing primarily in the Philippines to accelerate growth and create more jobs and help build a better future for all.